Welcome to Newswatch Today. I'm Tristan Brooks bringing you the latest in international, national, and local news. A recent study shows that 48% of college students would consider themselves to be consistently hungry. This is due to the rising amount of student debt and the lack of money that students have access to while they are in college. There are some colleges that have attempted to combat this issue by opening food pantries that students are allowed access to throughout the year. Rashan Salam, the 1994 Heisman Trophy winner out of University of Colorado, was found dead in a park near his home in Boulder, Colorado. The former football player is said to have left a note to his mother detailing his plan to commit suicide. An autopsy is being performed to figure out his true cause of death. LeBron James, a vocal Hillary Clinton supporter and star basketball player for the Cleveland Cavaliers, has voiced his opposition to staying in Trump hotels in any of the cities that the team plans to stay in. This first arose this past week when the team traveled to New York City to play the, to play the Knicks. Crosslines, a local Springfield organization, outreach organization, announced a donation matching program that will, lead, that will take place during the holiday season of 2016. This program will match every dollar of every donation up to $37,800 during this time period. An earthquake that devastated Achi province in Indonesia's death toll has risen to 97 and counting. Search and rescue crews are still desperately searching for survivors of this 6.5 magnitude earthquake that struck earlier Wednesday morning, as may, many residents were beginning their morning prayers. Thankfully, unlike many other earthquakes in this region of the world, there are no reports of any tsunamis that have formed from this earthquake. However, many homes and shops were destroyed. The same province in Indonesia was victim to an earthquake and tsunami in, two, in 2004, which killed more than 80,000 people and left millions homeless. Now on to weather. It looks like it's currently mostly cloudy out with a temperature of 31 degrees and 9 mile per hour winds, humidity of 49% and a 40% chance of precipitation. Tonight it's looking like it'll be clear with a low of 19 degrees. Forecast for tomorrow looks relatively promising as we begin finals here at Evangel. It'll be sunny out with a high of 32, a low of 15, and a 10% chance of precipitation. Now onto the six day forecast. As we continue finals Friday, we will be mostly sunny with a high of 34 and low of 25. Travel weather Saturday for those who are leaving a bit early looks nice, being mostly cloudy, a high of 41 and a low of 35. Sunday through Sunday though, we're getting a bit of rain, a high of 41 and a low of 23. Monday and Tuesday won't change much from that with highs in the low 40s. Wednesday though, we'll get, we'll, we'll get a bit chilly with a high of 29 and a low of 17. Thanks for watching Newswatch today. I'll be right back with a quick walkthrough on vocal processing. Experience life with others. To not be just another face in the crowd, but to have a small community we can call family, we need to receive individual guidance from the wise and be sharpened by those we live with from day to day. We treasure the traditions of those who have gone before us and form lasting friendships with those who cross our path, knowing that the skills, the memories, and the relationships we've formed will journey with us no matter where we go. Evangel University. In 1977, an eight-year-old boy picked up the game of golf from his father. The odds of that same boy then making it to the US and European pro golf tours, one in seven million. The odds of Big Easy winning the US Open twice. The odds of him having a child diagnosed with autism? One in 88. Ernie Else encourages you to learn the signs of autism. Now it's time for This Week in Bad Stats. Bad stats? Horrible stats. Here goes. 260. That's how many runs were walked in with the bases loaded last season. Wow, very good. Here's a tough one, though. Three and four. No idea. That's the number of kids who witness bullying. Three out of four. Not a good stat. No, it's not, but that can change. Kids want to help, but they don't know how. You can visit stopbullying.gov and give them the tools they need to help prevent bullying. There are plenty of safe ways kids can help at stopbullying.gov. It's no fairy tale that the right fit means everything, especially when it comes to car seats. Always choose one that's the right fit for your child's age and size. That does make a difference. <laughs> to find out more, visit safercar.gov slash the right seat. 
Welcome back to Newswatch Today. We'll be continuing with a quick vocal processing walkthrough using Logic Pro 10. I'll be touching on, touching on dynamics processing, which will include compression, de-essing, limiting, EQ, harmonic and tape saturation, and reverb and delay. Let's jump right into it. So just to start out, I'll go ahead and loop this section here. Uh, this is the lead vocal that I'll be starting with, uh, and we'll pretty much uh, end with. So we'll just play it real quick. Funny how we go way back and we said that wouldn't let this come between Everything it is a truth that I can look back So the first thing I'm hearing, um, it seems like it's sticking out a little bit in the mix So I want to get it nice and, uh, nice and even and try and get it uh, stuck down in the mix So it's not popping out a bit too much So um, I'm going to grab um, this virtual mix rack uh, It's a plug-in bundle and then I'm just going to grab uh, I'm gonna grab a compressor here. Let me see if I can find it. Uh, I'm gonna grab this guy. So I'm gonna start. I'm just gonna dial up the input. With this, I'm looking for anywhere from like six to 12 dB of compression. Um, so what a compressor does is based on a ratio. Um, it'll uh, for every decibel it lets in, it'll uh, take down. It'll compress that many decibels. So a four to one ratio if it's letting. Um, one decibel through, if one for every four decibels, it'll let one decibel through. So, so I'm starting to like that. Let me A B it quick for you. All right, sounded good. Um, jump to EQ quick. Um, just grab this uh, EQ. It's based off a uh, old console, uh, SSL 4000. It's a pretty popular console. Um, so what I'm hearing EQ wise is I just want to brighten it up, try and get it to get that top end uh, that you hear on professional records. That sounded pretty good. Um, then I'm going to boost around 5K. Um, that's where all the consonants hit. So I'll boost like 3 dB of that. And then I'll boost a little bit of 2K um, just to get it a little bit, uh, get the nasally bit out of it. So. So that sounded pretty good. Um, uh, I'll go ahead and just uh, jump into some saturation just to get it a little bit distorted, get it to thicken up a bit. So I'll just dial this up. So I like to basically get this until it's uh, glowing just a little bit, not distorting all the way. But just to get it to distort a little bit, just to give it a little bit of life. Um, so after that, I'm going to jump into uh, a bit of parallel processing um, here. So what this is is just a copy of the vocal uh, after fader. Um, and I'm just basically going to mangle it um, and get it just so it keeps, uh, keeps the vocal in there basically all the time, regardless of how loud the uh, main track is. So I'm just going to grab the same thing, um, and then I'm going to grab this compressor, which I really like this compressor. It's very, very aggressive. Um, it's great for this application. So I'm going to go ahead and dial this and bring this up. Funny how we go way back, and we said that wouldn't let this come between. Everything it is a truth that I can look past. And dial in the makeup gain. Oh, your idea of me, blown away, away. Something's telling me I never could have ruined everything you want in life Cause you never put in effort in the tr And then I'm gonna grab uh, another saturation plugin And just turn that all the way up Funny how we go way back and we said and It's just straight up awful But let's add, blend it in here with the lead vocal Funny how we go way back and we said that wouldn't let this come between And let's hear it in the mix Funny how we go way back Just 
just adds a little bit of life in there uh, that I really like. Um, so uh, after that, I've got all these sends set up uh, to go to a plate and a delay. Um, so I'll go ahead and hit those quick. I'll just grab, um, grab this verb to be classic. Um, and then I really like this. I found um, there's a preset in here um, called Wide Rich Vocal Room. I really like it. Um, I'll dial up the decay a little bit. That's just to give the vocal a little bit of space. Um, and then I'll grab a delay just to give it a little bit of thickness. Um, it's by the same company, uh, Slate Digital. Um, this one. And then this comes loaded with presets, so I'm just going to grab this one. Um, and then I'm going to add a little bit of color. This is just a little bit of saturation. Um, and then I'll do that to get it a little bit separated. Everything it is a truth that I can look past memories and stay up saying Oh your idea I've got more secrets than you'll ever know Alright so let's A B this uh see where we got on it Funny how we go way back So this is before Just get it to pop out nice without reverb and delay And Looks like that's all the time I have for today. Uh, I hope you enjoyed this installment of Newswatch today. This has been Tristan Books saying so long.